This time around, Freeze is good. Genetics in the middle of three, but should be able to walk out as long as they don't get rooted. blocked or rooted in place. A great shot from Spud to lock him down. And Calvin from Hawk at least keeps him alive. I should say a blink, maybe a turnaround on the Lazbro Tornado. Just enough damage plus the dot from Herox is going to be enough. The blue stone tick ends up getting that kill. Mockingbird now at their second kill. You see Lazbro wrapping around mid. Oh my god. God, the damage from Lazbra and from Deeks there. Not sure how many charges Spell Leader had, but it felt like full at that point. Can't do and secure his blue buff. Does, not see, does seem to be so, but picked up into the sky and slammed down into the waiting arms of Deeks. Assassinate hits Lazbra, open the gates. Will not find the damage or the teleport they were looking for, but still, Team Risk are walking forward for this fight. Deeks and the rest of the team are completely content with fighting into Dominus Ross, even with two stun and a Kakul fiddle. It felt like it did nothing. It's a turnaround again. Deeks! It is something that can block off exits completely, like right there. Or it can be used to just slow. And Genetics has been mastermind of Ymir for a while. He seems comfortable on Ymir in Smite 2. By Genetics, charge up the World Weaver for Streak and fire it off for another kill for Team Risk. It started off a 2-0 start and lead for Mockingbird. Has gone now five unanswered kills and maybe adding another one. Odin Cage used, just walk away. They can't get through the cage. Well, never mind. You got a mortar. He can walk through any <laughs> wall possible. And Lazar will do just that. Or charges right at him. A Mordred. Pick him up. Slam him down. Not the follow-up damage that they were looking for. Jax, full charge ultimate. And joining in is Streak. To clean up the kill, seven now for Team Risk. I was, well, was going to pose a question to you, but I don't even know if you've got a, a full answer for me here. Inbound, if you're Mockingbird and you're staring down the barrel of a 7,000 gold lead for Team Risk. I mean, you have to play through the one lane that isn't getting uber dominated. I'm pretty sure you just got to rely on Spud, gank this Neath, try to kill this Neath. Good trade there, actually, by Herox. Uh, trading one for one, Lasbra for Herox. It's, it's still not great. Especially if... Uh, oh, dude, yeah. No, not great at all. Ooh, pull him right back in. I, I do agree. You got to play through your one where you've got some form of at least... Yeah, this is when it becomes an oh, issue. Oh, no. Yes. Hawk can't even walk up. Blink wasn't available. His, he already placed his three down, so he didn't have that dash available. This is when it becomes an issue. Lazbra misses the ultimate. May even pay with his life here. Movement speed stance. Assassinate in. Lazbra's going to get caught out for sure. Pay for sins and maybe even Streak a rotation from the solo laner through the teleporter. It's getting that one big damage though from Streak. Not quite enough when it's just become a death ball comp. One Hawk. pulled back through the realm and Variety even takes the portal himself to get away from Hawk's ultimate. Will be spared at the end of it all in genetics by himself just walking down. Through. It's like a last effort by Herox here. No ultimate available, no blink available. Just tried to get some damage onto the backliners. This is there's protections from this fire giant. Deeks takes no damage. It, like Herox doesn't even have his trans stacked. That was his first item. He can't even farm in his own tier two tower. <laughs> the, this this is a rough spot right now for Spud. Lazbro's gonna chase him out. Doesn't get the distance for the ult kill, but get what they were looking for on the side of Team Risk and to do and finally goes down. Herox though he's sneaking right back into the back line once more. Can he get the damage he's looking for? He does get a kill on the streak. I guess the reset on that invisibility. But he jumped, Dudu ju jumps in a little bit too late, isn't able to secure it, and probably will die for it. Yeah, three chasing him down. Damage from the Hakate. Good streak. Does get the final kill. And said it is a double stun from the belch and intoxicate to slam down the last chunk of HP from Spud's health bar. Team Risk with Fire John all five. No towers left standing, just Phoenixes. Lasbra picks up two, slams him down. Doesn't get the kill just yet. Double Sun from Calvin in the back line, but Titan down to 2k HP and down to nothing. Team Risk in the semifinals. Take it cleanly and we'll move on to the grand finals. There's just something about watching Team Risk play the map, play objectives, play team fights.